Greetings. I'm Pastor James Francis Brooks, and I serve as the pastor of the Lily Baptist Church of Brummett Heights. And today we have some pearls from the pastor. Now, if you find pearls, I mean that which is valuable. Uh, you can see the spiritual reference to that. Uh, pearls are valuable. I'm going to continue in our teaching from the Psalms. The Psalms. First of all, I told you last week that the book that we call the Psalms is uh, originally named the Book of Praises. The Book of Praises. For that's what Psalm means. Mm -hmm. Praises, the book of praises. And it's also suggested that it should be uh, sung, accompanied to string music. David wrote most of the song. We know that he was a musician, and we also know that he was a shepherd. Mm -hmm. And they have the shepherd's harp, it's a small harp that uh, kind of like you could carry along with you when he was out uh, on the field with the sheep, he could sing and play this small shepherd's harp. As you know, the harps that we have in the orchestra is a huge thing. This is not what it's talking about. They're uh, smaller harps. And the Book of Psalms are uh, poems uh, poetry with uh, they are rhythmic they are uh, with rhythm so that they can be set to music and uh, uh, they uh, uh, were written uh, over a great period of time over a hundred of them have a title they have a title that goes with that song and it also sometimes explains uh, what the psalm is about. That's what was originally in the writing. Amen. Amen. They all were not written by David, but most of them were. They are beautiful. I think I said last week that in your time of trials and sickness and pain, we can always look to the psalm for great consolation at this time. Also, there are, uh, are, are psalms that are easy to remember, like the Lord is my shepherd. And that's something that you can uh, commit it to memory so that whenever you're in a situation, you don't have your Bible, you can relate to the psalm because it is, uh, it has rhythm to it, will help you to remember it. Amen. 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 Now I told you that there are 150 psalms yes. last week. There were 150 psalms, and those psalms by the early rabbis were divided into five books. Divided into five books. And each book has its own doxology. And uh, each book has uh, a doxology, a final blessing. And Psalm number 150 is the doxology for the whole work of all, all of the Psalms. Amen. Amen. Psalm number 150 is the Doxology for all of the Psalms. Amen. 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 Let's look at, now last week we kind of looked at book one. Book one. And book one is Psalm number one through Psalm <clears throat> number uh, 41. Put them right there. Amen. Let me get to it here. Amen. Psalm one through Psalm 41. Mm -hmm. And the Soxology to Book 1 
is uh, the last part of Psalm number 41. Amen. But you, O oh Lord, be merciful to me and raise me up that I may repay them. Uh, by this I know that you are well pleased with me because my enemy does not triumph over me. As for me, you uphold me in my integrity and set me before your face forever. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel from everlasting to everlasting. Amen and amen. Amen. So Psalm number 41, part B, is the doxology to book number one. Now tonight we're going to talk just about a minute about Psalm book two. Amen. They have book one, amen. which is Psalm number one through Psalm number 41. Now book two is Psalm number 42 through Psalm number 72. Amen. Psalm number 42 through top Psalm number 72. Amen. Doxology for this for Psalm number book two. Yeah, you with me now? Psalm book two and the doxology to book two is Psalm number 72. Amen. And this is what it says. And it just makes you short, just jump for joy. Blessed be the Lord God, mm -hmm. the God of Israel, who only does wondrous things. And blessed be his glorious name forever. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. And let the whole earth be filled with his glory. Amen and amen. Amen. Let the whole earth be filled with his glory. God bless you and God keep you. Here's my prayer. Next week we'll talk about the next installment will be Psalms Book 3. Amen. And then there are names for each one of these books, and I'll give them to you at the end. My brothers and sisters, go with the Lord. 